whether you're new to tree climbing or you've been doing it for a while, uh, you're bound to come across the hitch counter pulley. Uh, it's a very popular piece of equipment um, and designed specifically for uh, this type of setup. So I think this is probably the best uh, rope on rope setup that you can get for moving rope system. It's also really nice because you, once you, if you progress to stationary rope system at some point, uh, you can still utilize this with a rope wrench. Uh, so it's a good investment to make. Um, but to set this up, you're gonna need a climbing line with a hand splice or machine termination on the end of it. Uh, you don't want to run a knot because the knot can actually interfere with the prussic uh, while you're climbing or ascending or something like that. So this is going to keep it streamlined and uh, prevent it from interfering with the prussic. Uh, so the hitch counter pulley by DMM, two oval carabiners, as well as a prussic cord of, uh, of your choice. So it can kind of look a little weird at first to set up, but it's actually fairly straightforward and, and simple to do. Uh, so that's what we're going to do right here is just show you how to set this hitch counter pulley system up on your moving rope system. Uh, so first thing we're going to do is use this hitch counter pulley uh, along with one of our carabiners. Okay, so we're going to put this on the rope. Okay, carabiner through the middle hole and then through our climbing line. Uh, if you want to, uh, it's depending on your preference. You can go through the climb line first before you connect onto the hitch counter pulley, uh, which can actually help while you're in the tree. And if you need to uh, just change your tie-in point, this will make it a little bit easier because you have a little bit extra weight on the end of your climbing line. Okay, so we have that set up. And then we're going to take our prussic. All right, and we'll tie distal here okay so the tails are coming out opposite sides here okay and then we're going to connect this to the bottom hole of the hitch counter pulley okay and so that's it and then this would connect to our saddle um, but as you can see it's very efficient um, but you can also see right here, if we were to have a much larger connection here with a knot or something like that, uh, you run the risk of it actually interfering with this. So it may start to bump the prussic down uh, when you're not actually wanting it to, uh, to do that. Um, so something to be aware of. Um, another great thing about the hitch counter pulley is you can utilize the top hole, okay? Uh, it does bring this part of the rope closer to your prussic, so do be aware of that. Uh, but it allows another connection point for a lanyard, okay? So which is uh, when you're work positioning, trying to find uh, a safe and comfortable position to make a cut, uh, this could be a good solution here. So again, this is the hitch counter pulley kit. Uh, we sell several different kits, uh, but if you're looking, you already have the carabiners and the prussic, which you likely do, uh, just go ahead and check out the hitch counter pulley by DMM.